former NPP Member of Parliament for Asante Mampon, Francis Adainimo, has described the Mampon constituency chairman's conduct in frustrating his efforts to contest the party's primary as needless and one that beats his imagination. Speaking to TV3, Selom Amenya, he called on the party to find ways of making the processes simple. The new patriotic party opened nominations for a month for persons wanting to contest parliamentary seats at constituencies where the party has certain members of parliament. The period was characterized by tension and clashes of which some supporters sustained varying degrees of injury. The Mampo constituency where Francis Adainimo is contesting was one of such constituencies. After struggling to purchase his nomination forms, the constituency executives at Asante Mampong failed to accept his forms because the incumbent was submitting his form the same day, resulting in a clash leading to six people being hospitalized. He, however, successfully submitted his form at the regional office of the NPP. These challenges he describes as needless. So w would you say that it was a deliberate ploy by people in that constituency to stop you? Well, um, I do not want to speculate or conjecture, but uh, it's, it was beyond my imagination about the conduct of the constituency chairman, which I thought it was needless, it was unpleasant. Why should purchasing of nomination forms be, be uh, a challenge to anybody? In any case, the forms were printed or produced to be purchased. He insisted the eligibility of a contestant is to be determined by the vetting committee and not executives in charge of the sale of the forms. If there are any defects associated with the documentation, that should not be an issue to be contended at the submission uh, stage. So I think in future we should find a way for this process to be made simple so that uh, instances where some party executives are locking offices, running away, cannot be found. We need to curtail this kind of thing. He is confident of winning the primaries. Um, we are waiting for the schedule for the vetting, and I believe that I should be able to go through and, then, and go on with my campaign towards April 25th. I'm confident of victory. And that but does he still have presidential ambitions after contesting the sitting president and several others for the MPP's presidential candidacy in 2015. As we say, patience leads to victory. So it means that after this, we should expect you going high? Well, one thing at a time, let me repeat, and let us pray for healthy life. Going forward into the future, nobody knows. Yes, if you have a, an ambition, it is not wrong to have an ambition to serve your nation. The NPP will be holding its parliamentary primaries on April 25.